Hi students, now we are going to talk about the most important problem. Example 7.7, is very important. See the question. Two pistons of a hydraulic lift have diameters of 60 cm and 5 cm. What is the force exerted by the larger piston when 50 Newton is placed on the smaller piston? So very simple. So, this is the diagram. But now, we have the diagram. We have discussed the topic. We have the topic. So, we have to do the hydraulic lift. We have to do the force multiplier. Minimum amount of force is the maximum amount of force. We have to do the horizontal tube. We have vertical cylinder. I mean cylindrical pipe on the end of the pipe on the end of the pipe on the end of the pipe So, what do you see here? There is a piston and there is a piston But, what do you see here? In the cylindrical tube, the area of cross section is less That is A1 So, in the cylindrical pipe, the area of cross section is less So, that is A2 Okay, now I will put the force on the end of the pipe F1 What do you see here? 50 N if you have the particles in the surface, there are minimum number of particles. Here is the same thing. If you have one particle, you can feel the pressure. If you have the pressure, the pressure will spread spread. If you have the number of particles, the force will receive the force from the individual. If you have the overall force, the value will be the same thing. If you have 15 Newton, you can get the force to get the same force. That's why, if you have a vehicle in this case, if you have any other object, you can easily lift it. So, if you have 15 Newton, you can get the force to get the same force. Let's see here. Yes, first, we have a diameter of a piston. That's why, we have a diameter of a piston. We have a diameter of a piston. Diameter is 60 into 5 This is the diameter of this one This one is the diameter of this one This one is the diameter of this one So this is the first one This is the second one So this one is the diameter D1 This one is the diameter of 5 cm So this one is the second one D2 is the second So diameter D2 is 60 cm Okay, wow. so area on the A1 first is the second is the gate. So, area is the formula. This is cylindrical pipe. This is the area. This is cylindrical. But this is the area. Circle. So, this area is the area. So, this is the area of the circle. Pi R square. R is the radius. So, this is the radius. R1 is the diameter half. That is 5 by 2. 2.5. सेंटीमीटर अरे मैं इंगे वालों में रेडियस आर टू अपर्तो वाले क्यों डायमीटर डी टू ला हाफ है इच इस इक्वल टू सिक्सटी बाय टू अब दे थर्टी सेंटीमीटर ओके बाप गुड सो मैं रेडियस ओके अब अपर वेर ऐने कुर्द का गा फोर्स ये फोन वाले कुर्द का गा ये वाला बे ये फोन इस इक्वल टू फिफ्टी न्यूटन ये F2 is equal to question mark. If you have a smaller piston, you can force it. If you have a larger piston, you can exert it. That's what you can do. F2 is equal to question mark. F2 is equal to question mark. Now, we have a solution. We have a solution. First, we have to do the area. We have to do the area. So, the area is equal to the first piston area. A1 is equal to pi R1 square. Which is equal to pi R1 square. R1 is equal to pi R1 square. Then, 2.5 square. Correct? The centimeter is equal to 2.5 into 10 power minus 2 the whole square. Meter is equal to the meter. That is area A2 pi r2 square equal to pi into r2 इधरके 30 सेंटीमीटर सेंटीमीटर ना 10 बार माइनस 2 मीटर स्क्वायर इन्हीं फॉर्म ले लो ये ना करने के ना फोर्स एक्सर्टेड बाय द लार्जर पिस्टन फोर्स 
एक्सर्टेड बाय द लार्जर पिस्टन करेक्टा सो पर लार्जर पिस्टन आला इन द व्हीकल के एक्सर्टर के लिए फोर्स आता है ना F2 अब F2 is equal to Pascal's law. On the topic, I explain what it is. Final on the equation under the formula. F2 is equal to A2 by A1 into F1. This is the formula. So, F2 is equal to A2. A2 is equal to A2. What is it? Pi into 30 into 10 power minus 2 the whole square. What is it? 30 square into 10 10 power minus 2 the whole square. Radina minus 4. Divided by A1. A1 is that. Pi into 2.5 the whole square. Into the square 10 power minus 2 go. Radina square for another one. 10 power minus 4. In the inner case. Into F1. So by A2 by A1 into F1. F1 value in the. F1 is equal to 50 newton. So by 50. If in the 10 power minus 4, 10 power minus 4, cancel I wrong, 5, 5, cancel I wrong. By F2 is equal to 30 square, 30 into 30, you know, 900 divided by 2.5 the whole square. But 25 into 25, 625. But 2.5 into 2.5 now, 6.25 into in the 50. Okay. If you want to do this, 950 into 50, then 9.5 is 45. Then F2 is equal to 9.5 is 45. Here is 0, here is 0. 1, 2, 3. Divided by 6.25. What do you want to do? Divide by this. I will divide by 100. Then what do you want to do? Which is equal to this? 45,000 kilo lipoma. Yes. So, if you have F2 is equal to 45,000 into 10 power 2 divided by 6.25 into 100 and all. 625. Now, divide 25, 25, divide 5, 5, divide 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 45,000 less 625 on the 72 times circle into 10 power 2. Up F2 is equal to 72 and 0 seta 7200 newton. Up 15 newton could have been 7200 newton force on the inge provide out Correct. Another force multiplier. It's very, very important problem. And I'll tell you practice. Panga Marakami, the friends share panga. All the rest. Thank you.